hamwe rero na Holland Green Tech hamwe na company Yago and Grow twabazaniye imashini tuzadukoresha mu buhinzi izo mashini zizaza zije kuduha ibisubizo ku bibazo dufite hano mu Rwanda urebye nk'uko mwabibonye ku mashini zimwe dufite imashini zibazi igenda zikata nk'ibyatsi bya bisigazwa by'ibihingwa biba byasigaye ku butaka irazi kabikata Neno noho hari mwabonye ko hari nindi dufite izikavanga bya byatsi na nubutaka nko kuri santimetre 5 hari yindi za nka ku butaka bukomeye cyane ikaba yabumenagura kugira ngo igihingwa kibe cyazahagera kibashe kuba cyakurura imyunyungugu ndetse habe hano no gutembera kwa mazi mu butaka ndetse numwuka bibe byagenda neza ku gihingwa The main goal for me coming here was to see uh, the demonstration being done um, by um, Holland Green Tech about the new technology or the technology that has been there to help assist with the small scale farmers uh, mechanization. So what we saw in the field being demonstrated was the use of a two wheel power tiller, um, a rotavator, the planter, uh, mulching mower. There were quite a bit of uh, attachments that um, we have seen there. And uh, personally, I think um, uh, it's a good start for the small scale holders who are really struggling to get um, onto the feet of mechanization. So it is um, really a good thing to see this happening. And um, I think this is going to help the farmers in a great way to deal with the land preparation right on time before the rains come, as well as planting that is precision for the farmers to get um, good high yields that are expected of so that they can get extra income with agriculture. I'd like to, to show you the, the final result. We did the soil preparation and the final bit that was the, the seeding. So let's just see if we can find some of the seeds. And there you can see it's nicely placed. So here you can see the seed placement. So as it, as it is a multi-purpose crop purpose that we, are, that we are approaching for, you can see that we planted one line of maize to demonstrate, and then on the other side, one line of French beans. Kandi chindi ibihingwa yote kwa bite ya kumurongo vijira umusaruro mnishi mukomu mwa wanyo tu kuche zina machine ngi itera ibihingwa vabiri ku kubudia kuzimu budi wumge. Kubujo iyo bime iyo bimeze bimera kuchijero chimge kandi ba kamera ijihe chimge. So here you see we created the soil profile, which is nicely loose. Roots are capable to enter, and also water is able to to go into. In this method, in this procedure, we are really enhancing the root zone and the growing conditions of the crop. And, and that will result in, in, a higher, in a higher yield. That's the final the destination. <laughs> and as well resulting then in a higher profitability of, uh, for a farmer. Uh, it's a good uh, technology and it will be helping our small scale farmers to mechanize their fields. Uh, we found um, a small uh, power tiers, uh, two wheel tractors with all attachments that are really portable and um, and they can be also used on uh, terraces yeah it's a really good time uh, wh when we have been looking for an appropriate technology uh, to work on uh, terraces to mechanize terrace farming and um, we really appreciate uh, the timely uh, activity by green green tech uh, bringing uh, this new technology in Rwanda today's workshop was interesting because uh, most farmers, especially who are moving from subsistence to small and medium scale commercial, basically growing for the markets, have a big issue with the cost of production. And one of the issues with the cost of production is basically tillage. So these small tools give us an option between the very expensive and cumbersome uh, human labor, you know, for tillage, and also the bit of uh, a bit of the, the tractor use, the mechanization using tractors, which are a bit expensive and not accessible. This is a middle position that is cheaper for the farmers, can be used for small scale 
farm plots and there are very many options around this technology including purchase by farmers as well as renting. At the end of the day the farmer can save money, the farmer can increase their income and overall we can improve livelihoods of many Rwandans who are involved in the farming sector as well as introducing jobs to people who are going to run uh, these working tractors and the small mechanization we've learned today in the workshop. So overall, I'm grateful to Holland Green Tech and uh, we look forward to implementing this.